I don't think this does anything. Yeah, dude, we're literally inside a wooden block. What? It's the moment of truth. Okay, the moment of truth. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another awesome Minecraft Pocket Edition video for you guys today. Now, before we get started with such an awesome and spectacular video for you guys, um, if you guys are brand new to my YouTube channel, make sure you guys are subscribed, and whether you're new or not, make sure you have that bell, that notification turned on. Go hit that bell down below, turn on my YouTube notification so you guys can be notified the moment I upload a brand new video so you guys can, you know, watch, enjoy, leave a like on the video and all of that. And you know all that cool stuff and just like I said about leaving a like let's try to hit a like goal for today's videos Because you guys know I love my likes and I love you guys So if you guys can go hit that like button you guys know how much love there will be in today's video Now guys if we could hit actually you know what for the like goals lately you guys have been going absolutely insane I think we literally aimed for five or six likes yesterday and we literally got like seven likes So for today's video guys if we could hit seven likes that would be absolutely crazy So go down there and smash that like button completely crush it annihilate it share that like button make that like button blue and you know just just super awesome and blue share it break it make sure that like button cannot work after you guys smash that thing down below and let's see how many likes we can get i don't know if we can get seven again but if we get seven that would be absolutely amazing and yeah guys just like the title states i will be showing you guys how you guys can live inside a block in minecraft pocket edition now, actually, my friend Brandon Crafter, if you guys want to check out his channel, the ch you know, link to his channel will be linked down below, underneath that like button down below, and everything you guys will need is underneath that. So under after you guys hit that like button, you guys can go check him out and all that. He actually set up this map completely for me, because lately he made a video called How Do You Know Um Live Inside, um, I think, a cobblestone block. So I'm like, yo, dude. That's so cool. It's awesome that you made a video like that. And, you know, he says, yo, if you want, you know, I, you, he can hook me up with a map to show you guys how you can live inside a wooden block. Like, just one wooden block. So, just like I said, guys, the, his channel is called Brand Crafter. So, if you guys, for some reason, don't hit that link, you guys can look him up on YouTube. Check out his channel. Really good friend of mine. Makes really cool stuff and awesome. So, um, basically, it's how to live in any block. But today, we're going to focus on wood. So, yeah, wood. Just like that. Except, you know, only one. So, this is just a random block prank. So, um... I don't think this does anything. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. It's just like a wooden block there. So that does absolutely nothing. I don't know why he has beacon set up. That's pretty cool. All right, I like that. Um, walk on to enter. If there is no button, stand on the head and do slash set block wooden. What? If there's no button, what? What head? Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so ring your doorbell. All right, I guess we start here. Oh, what? Dude, we're literally inside a wooden block. What? Wait, okay, wait, okay, let's look at the house real fast, okay? It's, like, complete with paintings. You get, you guys get a nice couch to watch TV. Another painting here, some bushes, some plants. I don't know why there's an end rod, but you guys get, oh. Oops, okay, you guys get an end rod. And over here, you get, I guess, a cool room. There's your bed, there's my head. I don't know why it's there. Nothing in a chest, really, but you guys can literally fill this up with whatever you guys want if you guys just want to live in a block. You know, it's really spacious, really. You guys got a cool library here. You guys got a book, which is, um... What is this book? Smite. Okay, not really the best book ever, but you guys get books, I guess. You know, we don't really read them. We just use them from chanting. And you guys get a crafting table here to craft literally anything that you guys want. So that's pretty cool right there. I do like that. So cool how this works. But the question is, how does it work? Now, if you guys want to leave, I think all you guys need to do is click this, and you guys are back here in the middle. And that's so cool. I like how it's in here, so it looks like you're, like, teleporting out or something. I don't know. Oh, uh, what's this, though? Walk on to enter. Okay, Brandon, this is actually nothing. What the heck, bro? There's a head, but... What? Okay, okay. So I know a lot of you guys are probably wondering, how does this work? Like, okay, so this block is literally your home. Ring the doorbell, you're in, you're inside the block. You live inside a one-by-one -one block area. But how does this really work, guys? Well, that's what we're going to try to figure out today. So we already know it involves a lot of command blocks. So, you know, we got we to gotta dig deeper. We got to see how the magic works, guys. So I'm pretty sure, yup, just like I thought, there is a command block down there, guys. All right, all right. So let's switch to game mode. Um... See, I guess that would be the best way to do this. We're in creative mode as of now and see what the commands are. So the commands are to teleport to that specific area. 574-47-124. 
Alright, so... Yeah, that's the command that's set there, and um, I think that's the only command. Yeah, it really is the only command. So I think the real thing now is we need to check out, you know, um, the area around the actual quote block unquote. So in order to do that, you just gotta break out of the house, check it out, see what there is to offer. Oh, no way, we're actually underground, okay. So that is very, very suspicious. All right, so I have an idea. We're gonna play a little bit of survival Minecraft, boys. We need a little bit of gear just to, you know, um, just to, you know, be able to see what's in this map. So you guys already know we got punched some wood. We're actually gonna set up some gear. I want to see where the location of the house actually is. Cause you know, I don't wanna just be in creative mode, flying around, figuring out how things are. When you can, you know, just do it the fun way, mine some stuff and all that. So we're gonna, you know, mine all the stuff. By the way, let me know in the comment section if you guys ever wanna see like a survival let's play on my channel. Cause it's been so long since I've done one. And I don't know, I like, I like let's plays. They're pretty fun, you know. You can literally set everything up, like, just have a lot of fun with it. So let me know that in the comment section below. Maybe we could try living in a cobblestone block or something while we're in there. I don't know, guys. But we're gonna grab this little guy here, and I think that should be all the wood that we need. Maybe we should grab more just in case. Um, we're gonna grab more just in case. You know what, just in case anything happens, there we go. Go up this tree, break this stuff down super fast. I know we're taking quite a bit, guys, but don't even worry. It's nighttime, so we gotta get to our cobblestone house. The cool thing about this is, you know, like, let's say you live on a, like, a server or something, and you have this all set up, um... No one can tell. No one can tell it's there. And you just put a block down anywhere and people are just like, you know, um, yeah, like, let's say it's a grass block, right? Like, if someone sees this grass block, you literally live in that grass block. And, you know, no one can tell, guys. So, alright, alright, it's night time. Let's go do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Alright, alright, alright. Back inside the block. Alright, alright, guys. So, it's night time. Let's go skip the night super fast. And we have no bed. So, what? Okay, we actually don't have a bed. Alright, we gotta live a little dangerously, guys. Alright, so, we need to break through the wall. So, we're just gonna, like, create an entrance. Since we wanna know where this is, we need to be a little smart about this. Alright, so, this is the secret underground base, guys. So, we do need a little bit of cobblestone. Again, we're just trying to find out. Oh, okay. That's interesting. There's some wooden blocks. What is going on? Hmm, I wonder. All right, so actually, this is my first time opening the map, so this is kind of a surprise to me. Oh, huh, okay. I don't know why there's wooden slabs down. That is interesting. All right. I think Brandon's being a little sneaky on us, boys. All right, let's see. Let's see what's up. Let's get a uh, better pickaxe made just so we can uh, mine stuff a bit faster. All right, looks like this is the area where, you know, um, uh, around the block. So I think all we need to do is just get out of here. Okay, so what the heck? Oh, yo, wait, what? Okay, wait, 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 wait. I just realized something. We still have the jumping effect. Yo, no way. No way. Wait, hold up. Hold up, guys. Can we do this? Oh, man. Okay, the jumping effect is not really helping us too much. Um, we need to, like, clear some headroom so we can actually jump on things. I just want to see what's on top here. It looks like he took the time to actually put lighting. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, so these are half slabs and... Oh, he used half slabs so there can be hidden lighting. I just realized there were like zero torches. And the half slabs are so we can put glowstone on top and light will pass through the half blocks. Okay. That is, that is so smart. Oh, dude, Brandon is a genius. Okay, we don't want to break that. We do not want to break that. Alright, so what we want to do is actually try to get on top if we can. Uh, okay, we're probably going to have to go from here. So we're going to stay up here, you know. Do our thing, do our thing, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. You guys already know, you guys already know. And we just gotta dig straight up, alright? So I'm pretty sure I know where we are. If I know anything about Brandon, alright, and the way he um, makes things, he's gonna go for literally the laziest way possible. No offense, my friend. But if I'm correct, we should be right underneath spawn, right? Okay, we're pretty close, dude. No way, Brandon. Alright, no freaking way, dude. You did not make it that easy. Come on, bro. But that's so cool. Your base, I don't know, like, it could be cool because you could also have your base, like, located so far away when, you know, in the illusion shows you're inside a block. But it's still so cool how that works. I like it. Let me know what you guys think about that. But okay, okay, we just, the moment of truth. Okay, the moment of truth is here. I see the beacon. How far away are we from spawn? Come on, let me see. Dude, we're literally just here. We were literally under these, what? 
Okay, okay, Brandon, you mastermind. See, you go down here, you exit, come up, and it is literally, oh my gosh, okay, that is so smart. I like how he did that. It's literally just a bunch of teleportation commands. But, you know, the magic is, it makes it seem like you guys live inside a block, so you guys get a bit of a cool thing to do there. So let me know what you guys thought about this video. Leave a like down below if you guys did enjoy and want to check it out. You guys try it out for yourself, you know what? If you guys do do this, you know, maybe make the best, you know, um... Block, like, let's say you live in a dirt block or a diorite block or even a cobblestone block, which, again, is on Brandon's channel. His link will be right there, guys. You know, I'm just saying you guys should watch it. He did a pretty good job on the video. I did like it. You know, maybe subscribe to him and check out his channel. But if you guys could do something like this or maybe make maps like this and, you know, show me on Twitter or link me on Twitter or just, you know, send it to my business email or whatever, I'd be happy to make a video on it. And, you know, it'd be so cool to see what you guys can create. So, I don't know, guys. I thought that was really cool. Let me know what you guys thought. You know, you know, we're inside. We're inside a wooden block, guys, all right? Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. We're actually inside a wooden block. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget to drop down a like. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section down below. And then, hopefully, some of you guys can make something like this, and it'd be pretty cool to showcase once again. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next video. And peace. Bye, guys, and woo!